that the presidential election held on 8th August 2017 was not conducted in accordance with the Constitution and the applicable law rendering the declared results invalid, null and void. It is this declaration by the Supreme Court that seems to have jolted a number of politicians who lost in the August 8th general election, the Fresh Polls, offering a silver lining for them to get their groove back. We are therefore very delighted today to welcome Governor Peter Munya into the NASA family, together with all members of the party of national unity. Former Meru Governor Peter Munya became the first poll loser to join forces with Raila Odinga's led National Super Alliance. Munya protesting that his victory was stolen. I want to be on the right side of history. My election was stolen when uh, the election of Raila Odinga and uh, Kalonso Musioka was being stolen. I was also canon founder <laughs> in that uh, <laughs> fight. And therefore, I cannot join those who stole my election and be working with them. And today, while hosting leaders from the Western region, this, a number of hitherto opposition party members pledged their allegiance to the re-election of President Uhuru Kenyatta. Leading the troop was this year's United Democratic Party presidential candidate Cyrus Jurongo, Vihiga County Progressive Party of Kenya gubernatorial loser Moses Akaranga, ODM's Bungoma gubernatorial race loser Alfred Kangati, among others. Also said to have announced intentions to join forces with Jubilee is Paul Otwoma, who unsuccessfully vied for the Busia governor's post as an independent candidate. Former Kakamega Senator Bonika Lwale, who lost his gubernatorial bid to ODM's Wycliffe Oparanya in a tweet on Sunday, said he was consulting widely on the subject of the fresh elections, his tweet drawing mixed reactions on his next move.